TV News. Meghan Markle's mother arrived in the UK today to be at her daughter's side ahead of her big day. But it is looking increasingly unlikely that Meghan's father will be with her on Saturday to walk her down the aisle. Thomas Markle, who's 73, is reportedly having a heart operation. Our royal editor, Chris Shipp, has the latest. The mother of the royal bride-to-be is in the UK this evening. Good luck with the wedding! Meghan Markle's mum, Doria Ragland, outfit in hand, left her home in Los Angeles late last night. Our time, she has since been spotted meeting Prince Harry's staff at Heathrow Airport. Meghan's father, however, has not been seen. He is thought to be having some kind of heart surgery at this hospital in Mexico where he now lives. He's told the entertainment website TMZ he's having a stent fitted. And if that is the case, doctors here conclude it more or less rules out his attendance on Saturday. If someone's had a stent fitted, I'd really want them to stay five to seven days, maybe ten days in the country uh, so that we could make sure no complication had occurred. And if they've had a heart attack and they had a stent fitted, I really wouldn't advise flying three or four days later. I'd probably want them to wait ten days, two weeks before coming across uh, on a big flight. So plans are being made for someone else to take Thomas Markle's place at the wedding. And it would mean Harry will not meet Mr Markle before he marries his daughter. How different it all is to the days before the wedding of Harry's brother William to the then Kate Middleton. Her dad Michael did walk her down the aisle. No last minute change of plan and no pre-wedding photos with the paparazzi. A point not lost on Kate's biographer. Kate came from a very solid family and Kate had been dating William for, you know, from the moment she joined university virtually and, and so they had had a lot of time to get used to it and, and the stories that came out about her family came out over a long time. It wasn't in the run up to the wedding. The One thing about the wedding is however is going to plan. This is certainly something we could use. Right. The florist chosen by Meghan and Harry has been talking about working with the couple on Saturday's displays in St George's Chapel. Oh my goodness, it's going to look incredible in the chapel. I'm just, I think it's one of the things over the last few weeks, I just wanted to get in there and to be able to get started. We might not know who will accompany Miss Markle, but the florist is at least confident the bride will like what she sees as she walks down the aisle. So no news at all tonight on the health of the bride's father, but Meghan Markle does at least have her mother in the country. And if it, it, if it is going to be Doria Ragland who walks her down the aisle on Saturday, they can at least now make those final preparations and no doubt have a rehearsal or two inside St George's Chapel behind me. As for the meeting between Meghan's mother and the Queen, that hasn't happened yet. She has, after all, just stepped off a long flight from the USA, but there aren't too many spots in the Queen's diary, so I suspect that may happen tomorrow. Chris Shipp and Windsor, thank you. Moving on to other news.